All right, what is up, you guys? I'm here with the SummerSlam Complete Anthology. This is Volume 2, and we're going to be looking at 1994. So, well into the new generation era. I was never the biggest fan of the mid-90s, personally. You know, I like... I prefer more late 80s, but... Open it up here. We do have really small listing compared to the rest, as you can tell. Not much to go over here. But we do have some cool artwork over here. I always love when they include the poster artwork. Love it. Alright, so... Most of you know, I am not a fan of this event. The only really kind of strong point is, in my opinion, the real main event, which we will get to then. But we have Bam Bam Bigelow in IRS versus the Head Shrinkers. We have the SummerSlam Hotline. We have Alundra Blaze versus Bull Nakano for the Women's Championship. We have an interview with Shawn Michaels and Diesel. And then for the Intercontinental Championship, we have Razor Ramon versus Diesel. We have an interview with Lex Luger and Tatanka. And then Tatanka versus Lex Luger. More SummerSlam hotline. Then we have Jeff Jarrett versus Mabel. And then Vince McMahon and Jerry the King Lawler interview the members of the Hart family, which is pretty cool. Then we have one of the greatest... SummerSlam matches of all time. The steel cage match for the WWE Championship. Bret the Hitman Hart versus his brother, Owen Hart. Fantastic match. One of the best steel cage matches of all time. And, you know, when I watch a steel cage match, yeah, I want blood. I want, you know, violence. But this is one of those matches. It's like SummerSlam 2008, the Hell in a Cell match. Where sometimes you don't need blood to tell a story. Sometimes you don't need crazy violence. And sometimes it's best to just have a kind of toned down steel cage match. Because I don't feel like this would have worked if it was some bloody brawl. I think this was better off without all that. So this is a good example of that. And then the main event is Undertaker versus Undertaker. Blah blah. Whatever. I... I've always hated that whole program matchup, but it is what it is. You can see we even have the poster artwork. Yeah, there you have it. So, SummerSlam 94, I'm not a fan of this event, but it is worth watching for the Steel Cage match, honestly. Um, that is a five-star match, and one of the, truly one of the best moments of SummerSlam. So, 1994, let me know what your thoughts on this event was. This has been the DVD Freak. Peace out.